Hello, welcome to Memorial High School Technology Committee's video on how to import grades from a new Google form into Classroom and then export them into Power Teacher Pro. Let's begin. Assignment, and we're going to create an assignment. Instead of pasting an assignment like we usually do by adding a link, we're going to actually go into our drive and find a new assignment. So let me just type it up. SAT lesson 11 quiz and right, so we're going to go in here and we're going to search for our SAT 11 11 quiz right pd7 and now you see that with using a new google form since this was done in the new google form and not the old google form what happens is we have this option that's called grade import and that allows us to ingest the grades from the actual google sheet into google classroom so now we're going to assign it and wait so now we see that we have five not done we're going to enter it and we're gonna see that we don't have any grades here. So now we have this new import grade option, import grades option in the upper right corner. We're going to select that and import grades. And voila, you see, we have all these grades have been imported, every student in the class. So we no longer have to actually manually put in these grades. This step is extremely important. Now we want to return the grades. Click all the grades. And then we're going to return. Say yes. If you want to write a message, you can. Once they return, we're going to go to this right gear up here in the right corner. We're going to click download the CSV. We're going to have our grades open. Save it. It's going to be populated at the bottom of the screen. Next, we're going to go to our Power Teacher Pro, open it up. I already have the assignment prepared, 49 points. Here, I'm going to export the score template by going to the right corner, clicking the gear, and export score template. I'm going to save it. And then down here, once again, we're going to have a populated file that says SAT quiz 11. I'm going to open the grades first. As you can see, we have our grades right here. Next step is to open the SAT word quiz. And as you can see, we don't see any scores here and we can see that the names overlap. So usually I come up here and I open up the file a little bit, the column. I'll just copy, come over here, right click and copy. All right, you either right click or press, I mean, control C and then come here, select and then control V. And there you have it. Now I just close here. Don't need that anymore. I'm going to save it. Keep the format, yes. And close it. Save it again. Replace it, yes. Yes, and then we're done. Now, next step is come up here to the gear, import scores. Here we have file, format, validate students' names. The first thing we're going to do, this is always going to be clicked. We're going to go to browse files. We're going to find our file, which is SAT Word Quiz 11. We're going to open it. I'm going to wait, click next right here. And these usually are going to show up. It's just going to tell you that ignore the header. Since it's a header, you're going to ignore whatever goes in here. And then all the scores are going to be imported. As you can see, they match. Click import. And there you go. You have now imported your grades from Classroom into Power Teacher Pro. This is Juan Lugo for the Memorial High School Technology Committee. Have a great day.